Plug it in and get ready to rock. Sit your ass down with the hands of the clock. We're wearing a gay pineapple, so sublime. Like, comment, subscribe. It's Hello, hello, and welcome back to Pineapple Plus, the show where I play the month's PlayStation Plus games. I have already played this month Pumped BMX Plus, Lesser Quest Remastered, and the very enjoyable The Deadly Tower of Monsters. And now I shall be playing Everybody's Gone to the Rapture, which I think I've seen some of on someone else's YouTube channel. Uh, probably many a true nerd, I think. Someone like that. Um, but I cannot remember anything about it. So, <laughs> let's have a look. Ooh, it's a slow loader. This is Dr. Catherine Collins. I don't know if anyone will ever hear this. It's all over. I'm the only one left. Very dramatic opening with the opera music. I love the painting, or it just looks like an ink drawing, like a very well done ink drawing. Hmm. Oh, and I'm in. I'm in. Got in the matrix. Oh, there's a nice blur when you turn around for first person. This looks very nice. This is some depthy looking graphics. Nice, the light looks beautiful over there as well. I'm assuming it's all very fucked up because there's, you know, the rapture situation. That said, it still looks very nice currently. I want to continue to broadcast for as long as I am able. If I'm right, we should be able to pick up the signal right across the valley. The event has left markers. We don't understand it yet, but we're going to keep working to try and understand it. You can use them to find what you're looking for. The answers, they're all here. The answers are in the light. All right. What are the markers? There's a rapture cake. That'd be cryptic. Fucking hell. You want me to die? I hear a phone. I see no phone. Phone? Phone next door or something? God, I'm slow. Is there a way to speed up? Uh, the phone is to tell me where to go. Ah. Strange place to leave that. This is a special announcement by the Emergency Measures Committee. Due to exceptional circumstances, radio and television in this area has been brought under the control of the EMC as per the Crisis Preparedness and Action Bill of 1982. Keep your radio and television on at all times. Stay indoors and avoid contact with other people. But I'm outside and I turn the TV off. outside your local area. Or I'm telephoning outside. and remain civil and calm. Stay tuned to this station for updates. Oh, this isn't really a telephone, is it? It's sort of like a emergency comm system. Oh, so I'm not going to stay indoors, mate. That sounds dull as fuck. Let's go get involved in the rapture. Nick a van or something. It's just knocking about. The keys inside? Let's just drive away from the rapture. Oh, I really wish I could walk slightly faster. It's kind of infuriatingly slow how fast you walk considering there's a fucking rapture. Oh. Oh. 
Well, I've got psychic powers. Right, I can move this. I'm not sure why. Is what it's doing for me? Is it the signal? I'm trying to do my job. You two will be the only staff on site for this rotation. I'm just saying, if the main gate's power fails, then there's no way in or out of the observatory. That's why there are backup generators. Jesus, why the hell are we even discussing this? Just don't you come run into me if you get locked in. If we get locked in, we won't be able to come running to you. Oh, I just thought. You let us worry about the clever stuff, and you can concentrate on sweeping up leaves Apart and changing from, light bulbs. Apart from, obviously, their accents. Now piss off. I take it this is British. The car, the uh, steering wheel was on the right-hand side. Of me doesn't mean you have to take it out on everyone else. Kate, can we just talk about this? No, Stephen, I'm done. I just want to get out of this place, and tonight is our best chance of doing that. You prep the arrays. I'm heading up to Tower Six. Kate, I love you. You know that, right? Yeah, I know that. Oh. Come on, let's get started. Cold. So I can't run. Can't jump. Just got to sort of mill about. And use my psychic powers to learn stuff. Oh, hello. Well, hello, Jeremy. Slow down, Jez. I can literally only walk at a very slow pace. I'm even slow for walking. Space car important? Are you telling me to go down here? Well, I suppose from that we can assume we that they really are serious about this whole quarantine thing. If Mrs. Balfour wandered off that way before they closed the road, I suspect we'll never find her. Not until this whole thing blows over. But it's more than a little odd. I mean, this is Yorton, for goodness sake. There was no need for them to be so rude. Well, if they are so concerned that they are willing to close off the roads, I suspect they would argue that there is every need. What is certain is that for the time being, none of us are going anywhere. But he had a rifle, a soldier with a rifle in Shropshire. The world's gone stark. Uh, yep, we're in Shropshire. I have a good mind to write to my MP. You do that, Barb. And I'll personally deliver it for you. Once this blockade is removed, anyway. Come on, Bob. I can't spend all day chasing pensioners around the valley. The surgery won't open itself. I need to grab some paracetamol when we get back as well. Fucking headache all of a sudden. Phone box ringing. Yeah, of course it is. I could see a phone box in the distance, and I thought, no, yeah, that's gonna ring. Using the observatory as a conduit I haven't picked to up the phone. Spreading its range beyond the valley. Kate, we can't afford to let it do that. It's not our phone's right. It's stronger. I'm going to call Clive back and I'm going to force him to order the strike. I just don't see what other choice we have. For God knows Clive, if can you hear me? We need help. Who are you? And getting away from the phone. That was concerning. I'm questioning whether I'm Kate. See, I can't see who I am and I can't speak. They're all trying to talk to Kate, but that doesn't necessarily mean I am Kate. I can just be someone else who's listening in while they're trying to communicate with Kate. Communicate. Oh... This is very weird. Don't be so hard on yourself. We've all had rejections. You haven't. <laughs> Come on. We'll look at the figures, tighten up the data, and resubmit. Your core ideas sound, you just got the numbers slightly wrong. Don't patronize me. I'm not patronizing you. 
I think you are a brilliant man, Dr. Appleton. And you could have got a nine. Appleton. Listen. Crack a ton of apples. I'm here, right? We're together, you and me. The alignment event tomorrow. It's yours, okay? You saw the opportunity. The stars. The numbers, even if they can't see it. I'm proud of you. Is that supposed to make me feel better? See you then. Look on the bright side. I'm around here. Oh, because that's gay. <laughs> You're a hero. Prodigal son returns, right? <laughs> I'm surprised they haven't erected a statue in your honor yet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can laugh all you want, but I'll bet the parish council have a subcommittee working on that right now. <laughs> <laughs> so, I could be Kate seeing my own past in weird, disjointed flashbacks. But again, I could just be finding all this stuff out about Kate. I could be one of the other people in the story. I could be a horse. Just here to acquire this hay. Oh, phones. I'm scared of phones now. Extraordinary. The whole thing reminds me of high school. <laughs> Seeing Mars for the first time. That same rush of excitement <laughs> my hands are shaking this has just got such an eerie feel stars at night should we just all go to the pub have a nice cold pint and wait for this to blow over it's only a rapture isn't it oh there's a phone Oh, end of the day, 50p. Have a laugh. Where's this? I'm going to the rapture. 50p. This game is done very well to very early on make you terrified of phones. Oh, what's this way? Oh, radio. I keep looking, but it makes no sense. The area we picked the pattern up from can no longer be located on the scope. That's just not possible. You can see significant changes to the quality of the ambient light in that part of the sky. It's overexposed. Like a Polaroid left in direct sunlight. Hmm. Where else to go? Oh, there. That's good. Every time I go to say that I need some indication, it happens. outside here as well. Is that supposed to make me feel any better? You know, I understand it's difficult. That's all I'm saying. Your lot up at Vallis have never mixed with the local community. People here, they don't really understand what you do up there. Are you trying to get me to come to your church? It's not just about faith. It's about the community. Be involved. Be seen as part of it. One of them. <laughs> Good morning, Father. Lovely day. <laughs> oh, hello. Uh, Mrs. Appleton, isn't it? It's Dr. Collins. Lady scientist, whatever next. Good morning, Barbara. <laughs> Father, we know. You really think that's a community that will ever see me as one of them? I can live with them staring at me if they just stay out of my way. Hmm. So the locals are somewhat well. I'm not going to judge all the locals. That lady was rather old-fashioned minded. So, the floating ball of Jeremy appears to be touching that shop. The shop seems like a good location to look at. Then over the bridge. Playground? Yeah. yeah. That's probably in a peculiar pattern. I saw you doing that. Stay away from me. Don't come near me. This is people's property. You're scaring them. It's all over the village. It's got into everything. It's so fast. What are you talking about? It's travelling down the wires. Dear God, when you lost your mind? Where is Kate? What have you done with her? Don't you understand? 
is breaching the quarantine and adapting. Give me that bloody can. Hand it over, Appleton. Look, get off. Oh, Sam, stop it. You weedy little shit. Give it's mine. Give me the can. Give me the can. Stop it. Grow up. Starting to manifest itself everywhere. Oh. Stephen, come back. Oh, Christ. Well, the swell's part of whatever the thing is. Oh, fuck off. It's swirly like this thing I'm looking at currently, isn't it? Is this just a big old ball of rapture? Oh, there's a nice church up there. That'll be one of them. Oh, one on the bridge. Is everything right? Get out of my way. Where's Kate? Where do you think she is? Stephen, what's going on? Screw Kate. It's all her fault anyway. What's that mark on your face? Stephen! Stephen! Oh. The mark on his face. Is it swells? Is it this? Is that the mark? Ooh. Early call. Might be a bit early. I haven't played much of this game yet. I don't know what I look like. What if I've got some swirlies on my face? What if I am the rapture? Oh. There's no one here. It's opened up. It seems weird to have left it all opened up if you can't do something inside it. Mag, come and have a look at this. Oh, I don't believe it. Charlie! Jeremy reckons someone had been raiding all the empty houses. He said a load of stuff had been taken. What's up? Well, it looks like someone's been collecting their own supplies. Bastard. Well, we've got enough stock in the warehouse to keep the entire village going for months. We should get a truck. What, well, and go and get all of it now? Yeah, why not? It's Appleton. It's that bloody crackpot, Stephen Appleton. I'm going to fucking do it. Sam, it's fine. We'd better get moving before the weather turns. You come in. We'll swing by the camp and get Rachel on the way back. Where are we going, Jeremy Orb? To this house. Go inside. I hope the direction of this doesn't matter because I'm always going to the same direction. Not many people are moving around now. I was looking for Dr. Wade. Listen, Frank. I don't know what's happened, but your Stephen seems to think he's responsible. Uh, I reckon he is. He said uh, Kate's still up at the observatory, but the gates are locked. Which is where I started. Frank, there's going to be a rescue soon, I'm sure of it. They'll send planes or something. Well, they'll send planes all right. This pattern of it, we're in the center of it. Which means if they intend to stop it, we're right in the firing line. Mm -hmm. Oh, fuck it out. Oh, something not great's happened up here. This might be one that's worth explaining, game. there blood on the floor outside now yeah look blood more tissues where are we going come on Jeremy or keep going to the church okay oh there's a raffle Father Jeremy. Oh, of course, that's who I'm following. It's getting a little uh, Are you there? easy to forget who's who. Can you hear me? Are, are you out there, you bastard? You got them all? Uh, you got them all? Jesus Christ. 
Christ, help me, O oh Lord. Give me strength. Hello? Hello, is, is anyone there? Is anyone still there? Oh, oh. You are still here then. Should have expected that. Hit me. Come on then. Let's get this over and done with. I've got my parishioners to attend to. Am I the rapture? That's what it's starting to feel like. It's starting to feel like, more like I'm the problem rather than an observer. Am I just death right now? And those aren't flames. Those are swirlies. The death swirlies. I'm terrified. Oh, fuck. I was wrong. Their line... ...is gone out through all the earth. The lion. And their words to the end of the world. In them... ...hath he set a tabernacle for the sun. Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Oh God. Oh God. Oh. He's dispersed. that him being raptured. Oh, this game is deep. It's open now. Okay, this is beautiful and terrifying. There it is again. Um, I think I'm going to leave it here because I think that's enough of the story to get you into it to go and play it yourself. Um, and I don't know where else to go. This could go on for a very long time. This is really, really well done. The story is really cool. It's got the, the most game feel. It just feels so eerie and so bleak. And it looks amazing. Um, it's well acted as well. In terms of gameplay, obviously there isn't really much. It's basically an interactive story more than anything else. Uh, but it's a very well done interactive story. I don't feel like I need anything to do. I'm just curious to find out what's going on. Because the story is so good and it's so well acted. It's kind of hard not to be just absorbed into what's happening. I don't think I need like a task or something to work out. That does detract from it being a game, which makes this kind of hard to score. Because 
I'm supposed to be judging this as a game, but as an experience, it is very highly rated in my eyes. But as a game, there isn't a lot of game to it. Um, but I suppose I should judge this as to whether you should download it and what it feels like. So, how much it's worth downloading, I guess I'm going to give this an 8. Alright! If I were to judge it as a game, it's not. So far, it's not a game, so I can't judge it as a game. Um, if you want to play a game, go download the Deadly uh, Tower of Beasts, or whatever it was called. Um, which was very, very good. It's an interesting game. That was a lot of fun. Uh, but this is something else. This is definitely worth going to have a look at. It would be nice to have some gameplay. I feel like The Last of Us is still the biggest game to go for a really big narrative, but have a lot of gameplay in it. Um, but narrative-wise, this is definitely worth going to check out. So definitely go download this and give it a go. Anyone can play this. I think anyone would in the story if they're into this kind of bleak stuff um but it's very easy to play so that's it for this episode and i'll see you next month for some more playstation plus games on pineapple plus bye bye but they all know who i am the psycho house girl Oh, don't say Psycho House. I'm in there.